Back with Scott Evans and Sam McGee after day two at White Knights. Both through to the quarters tomorrow. Well done, lads. Thanks. Uh, Scott, first of all, talk us through your main singles. You played Cast of Finland. Uh, yeah, it was a fine match for me. Uh, I uh, My tactic was to go in and play uh, with a bit of high speed and, um, and attack, attack a lot. Of, and uh, yeah, I think I did quite well. I, I made a lot of mistakes at the front of the court, actually, which was... You know, I, I which I did well the first day, and then today wasn't that good. Um, so I'm gonna need to be a lot better uh, at the front court for for my quarterfinal tomorrow against Billy Lang. So today's match, twenty minutes. Yeah, uh, it was a lot of short rallies. Uh, like I said, the the pace was up, so he, I guess, he found it quite hard to follow the pace and made a lot of mistakes and was doing a lot of wild uh, wild shots that, yeah, hitting in the middle of the net and. You know, fire out and stuff. So, I guess my game plan worked worked quite well. Um, yeah. And again, for the line, the hall here. Do you think it'll suit your game or Vili's game better? I think it'll probably suit my game better. Um, if Vili is quite a defensive kind of guy, um, and this hall is playing quite fast, shots are quite fast. Um, so uh, it's gonna be a gonna be a good test tomorrow to see how I'm doing uh, yeah, with my preparation for the Olympics. Okay, and Sam, uh, you beat the young Russian pair this morning in the mixed doubles, Donna and Veronko. Uh, you meet another Russian pair <laughs> tomorrow. What do you think uh, that match will go like? I think it's going to be quite tough. Um, we, I played the guy Ash Marn in the doubles today. He's quite a tough competitor and always very fired up for these sort of matches. And the girl is a typical Russian uh, mixed player, quite awkward, so we're going to have to play her. Close to our best level to win this match, for sure. So, uh, in the men's doubles today, you said that you lost out. Um, do you think that that match will be good for the match tomorrow? Will you have learned something about playing Ashmaran or taking something from the game from the doubles? Yeah, I think that's the only thing we can really do now for me and my mix is to try and take something from the doubles and carry it on to the mix. Um, now that I've played Ashmaran, I'm quite familiar with the way he's playing and also where he's returning and what way he's, what way he likes to play and where he likes to hit certain areas in the court. So the only thing I can do now is uh, learn from the doubles and use it as an advantage in the mix. Okay, and Scott, tell us, what did you make of the men's doubles? Yeah, I think we played quite well actually in the first set and a half. Um, then uh, yeah, we started from the mid-court forward, we started taking it a bit lower. Uh, and then that gave them, you know, they were coming in on top of the net quite a lot, and yeah, we got into that kind of front court game, and and I'm I'm not that good at doubles at the front court, um, and I guess that that's that's where we, or that was where I fell down a little bit in the, in the men's doubles. I also think that they uh, they did a lot, uh, they did a lot during the rallies from from one and the, from one and a half set in. Uh, that you know that definitely irritated me a lot. Um, I don't know about Sam, but it really got to me. And uh, if I found it difficult to get into the game again uh, and get up to, to speed and stuff like that, like I was in the first in the first set. Um, so uh, you know th those kind of factors was was a little bit difficult for me today to deal with. And I think that's the reason why we lost. Uh, I think Sam played very well and. His tactics were good, and you know, quality in, in his serve, and, and at the front court was really really good. And my also when I when we played in the first set, I was you know perfect at, at the back, you know, holding the shuttle down and, and attacking quite well, and that's what we needed to do. But we 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 dropped down a little bit in this from the start of the second, and it just got worse and worse. And you know, they they stayed on top the whole time, and we we didn't really get a chance to break their rhythm. Um, you know, we never really, we never really got into the game from from middle of second set uh, for the rest of the match. You know, and when when you can't get into a, a men's doubles game, you, you don't really have a chance of winning. You know, um, so you know, so it was of course fun to play again with with Sam, and we always uh, we always get we always actually put ourselves in great situations to win. Uh, every time we have played together, we've been, you know, we've been having some really good games. Uh, like in the, the last time we played was Czech Open a couple of years ago, and we ended up having a match point in the semi final, beating some good pairs. Uh, you know, this time around we we have a chance of winning again, and and we don't take our chance. So I think it's a little bit of fifty fifty. You know, we've had our chances and we've taken them. And we've, and yet 
today we didn't take our chance. So. Um, some great individual performances though in the men's singles and mixed doubles, the two events that you concentrate on. Um, tell us, uh, Sam, what about preparations for tomorrow? Um, we Just after losing our doubles, we came back and uh, uh, got relaxed again and got uh, got some stress out of the way from the doubles. It was a hard defeat to take, but uh, now we've, uh, we've settled down, we've had a good meal. Going to try and get an early night now and hopefully uh, be fresh in the morning to start a new day. So we're going to have to take away today's energy and thoughts of the matches today and focus on you for tomorrow. So hopefully we'll be able to do that as best we can. Well, that's best of luck tomorrow. I hope you do well. Thanks. Thank you.